hello 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 everyone and welcome back to another art of conquest video i hope you guys miss me because i've missed doing this it's holiday season so i kind of took my time anyway today it's all about genji i did bought him it was on the on the chest i had nine chests left so i did open nine chests so i got him so we are going to talk about him but before any of that I hope you guys have a lovely Christmas and if we don't see each other again or if I'm not going to make uh, another video I want to wish you all a happy new year and I hope I'll see you guys well on the new year 2018 so let's go straight into Genji I'm going to look first of, at uh, his abilities. I only got him to level 18, but I'm going to explain everything. So this guy likes dumplings, huh? <laughs> Something I might have in common with him. So Genji, top chef, gladiator. A, ch a gladiator chef, that's something you don't see every day. Abilities, Spin Strike. <clears throat> Every so often, Genji launches a spinning attack that deals 7 damage to nearby enemies, hitting 3 times and pushing them back. So this is a crowd control ability which is boosted by Might. Next ability, Stunning Blow. Now this is what I hope that this ability stunning blow works hand in hand with spin strike so i hope they do work i'm still testing i'm still uh, still uh, playing with him so genji attack has a seven percent chance to land a critical hit that stuns the target and nearby enemies for three seconds so basically if this one works with this one uh when he does the spinning attra uh, attack and push everyone back, he also stun them, so that would be pretty nice. Spring Girl, now this is Rakan exclusive. Genji's substitutes the standard Rakan L with an improved recipe that heals Rakan fighters for 280 health within 5 seconds. After drinking it, stamina increased the amount heals, so obviously more points in this, more health. I'd say that this is pretty awesome. So if you are a rock and player, you must have this, this hero. I do believe that this hero might increase the survivability and might make rock and very very powerful in, in PvP. Because this guy also boosts the monks. So monks ma mastery i don't have to read it this is basically boost for monks guru and lamas if you are a rakan you want to excel as a rakan player you must have this hero powerful physic so he's a strong fellow after years of intense culinary training <laughs> genji emerged with a battle handled body granting him one extra might so obviously more points more might now this here comes the thing that i like about him it's meat dumpling it cost one energy jen just coughs down a huge nutritious meat dumpling that causes him to swell in size and enter a frenzied fighting state he immediately recovers fifteen thousand health his attack speed is increased by 35 percent and he takes 24% less damage lasting 20 seconds stamina increase the amount healed so stamina only increase how much is gonna heal huh? so obviously next one even better and then there is one more so I believe it's gonna be something like 32% 45% in increase attack speed and who knows how much health recovery anyway my opinion is that when you're going to use this ability if you have it maxed out i would say that you will going to grant him like an extra life <clears throat> as i mentioned 
Rakan, you must have been. Now I'm gonna say something about from a human perspective. For example, from a human per perspective, he's not the top gladiator you might want to have. So if you are a human, or maybe even a leech, or maybe even a, I don't know, Darf, and you wish Darf, they already have Gavgar, so no reason to put them. But human or leech, and you wish to have a, a gladiator, it's still Bane. Bane is still the, the, the top gladiator for human or, or leech but because it was not very accessible to me and this guy was about this guy so I'm going to invest in him but I'm, until then I have other priorities like I mentioned in my previous video priorities in order to make this guy viable and in order to make him good at what he is supposed to do because he being a gladiator you can see the amount of stamina he can have it's 50 might is 40 so basically they are tanking heroes but in order to reach that point when, when he is tanking you need to get his stamina around 120 and not just that you need, you need to level him let's say to level 40 being a, a max level castle as, as we are or as many players they are on, on this merge servers right now level 40 heroes is like the minimum level or let's say 35 with some exceptions all right but that would be the standard level that you i would set on, on this server right now or on heroes level 40. <clears throat> so obviously it's gonna require not just the uh, Stats investment is gonna uh, require uh, equipment investment as well. So obviously, a lot of divine items that will boost his stamina and his might. So these two, you have to max them out. And in the end, with this ability, he's going to bring a lot of might in the fight. So even if these two abilities are not going to be uh, working together, as they are supposed to he's gonna bring a lot of might into the fight plus this last ability i'm pretty sure he'll, it will make him very very viable and durable into the battle but still bane genji just for me genji was accessible i hope that was fairly understandable right so let's go against something like these guys and Test him into the battle. Let's put Genji down. Mess with me when I'm eating. And let's put some healers. And uh, I'm not sure if he's, if he's going to be able to to take all that. I don't know. Well, let's just try. It. Eat this. I'm trying to see if if he actually stands. So he does. So it is working. You can see the those circle around him. So what I'm I wanted to do is actually working. Now let, let's use his ultimate, even though he doesn't need help, the healers are doing a good job. Whoa! Now check about that range. So somebody stop this guy, I really like him. That looks phenomenal. Look at that, spinning and stunning. Imagine if you give him the dagger with another 30% more attack speed. For 20 seconds this guy is gonna be a beast. And the turtle just one shot <laughs> all these pesky skeletons. <laughs> That's it. Give them some more attack rating and whatever that L does from the turtle. Come on guys, time is running out. It's gonna be a timeout. No way. Genji. Eat your dumplings, man. 
defeat what <clears throat> anyway the whole point was to, to make make sure that it works so it does work and this is Genji and did you heard my opinion about him event we have a honor event and if you read the email I'm not sure if I have it yes honor war was it here next content so after this event pay attention is going to be the lumber rush rules compete to gather lumber once you have accumulated a certain amount of lumber you will be able to collect an individual by placing you'll be able to win a resource chest and dinari as your now i'm not sure if plundering is going to work because here it says gather so if it's all included together or not but my point is especially for players that are in a bur server obviously you have this uh, non-playing character npc or how you want to call them with a lot of wood so maybe you want to to save them for that event and just do them at that moment i'm pretty sure it's gonna help you a lot <clears throat> so this is pretty much about it shop there's nothing in the shop about everything oh yes i'm gonna <gasps> It's gone. No way. I want. I wanted to 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 spend my dinari and and try on Cleo. So it's gone. Oh my god. Anyway, take care, guys. And if I don't see you again, happy new year.